remarkable for its resemblance to human voice the traditional instrument is fading away except for a few players dedicated to preserving its place one of them being hom bagadur gandharva a sarangi player from sikkim since his childhood singing and playing the sarangi is a part of his daily routine he starts his day early in the morning gets ready and offers a little prayer to the gods and to the sarangi especially when the times are hard he needs to earn enough money every day to support himself and his children here every rupee counts sarangi is a stringed nepali folk instrument and is mostly made out of a single piece of wood it is played for so many years and has its own famous rhythm and tones alla gaila tu bare baitho velka in hinduism and buddhism gandharvas are divine musicians they are associated with creativity and art they are great entertainers with great skills in music and singing dad ganta go ajar ganta go ek seat sa sa seat sa gaadi mata ajar the boss no earlier the gandharvas used to collect and disseminate information they used to travel to different villages and spread news working as informants people used to wait for the gandharvas to receive any information but now the time has changed we have information at our fingertips through the use of radio television and mobile phones He sits in the corner of the stairways and he plays his sarangi. The sarangi is revered for its uncanny capacity to imitate the inflection of the human voice as well as for the intensity of emotional expression to which it lends itself.
यो गाइने दाजुला मिले भेटे को दस बारह वर्ष जो भो वहाँ लेम्रो यो सारंगी बजा हूँ दाजुला ब्रदर भैनीला सिस्टर दाजुला ब्रदर भैनीला सिस्टर बोलू पर्ने हाथ उठाए हेलो मिस्टर बाबालाई डैडी आमालाई मम्मी बाबालाई डैडी आमालाई मम्मी काकालाई अंकल भू मन में समझी समझे काकालाई अंकल भू मन में समझी समझे यो सारंगी चाहे ऊ बजा पर्च है सारंगी हमी को संस्कृति हो ये हम उगंधर्व जाति को एटा चिनारी नहीं हो सारंगी को हम कति मानी भू सारंगी चाहे कें बजाए तो भाई हम पुर्खौली पेशा भी हो एटा परंपरा भी हो अब एट गाइने गाइने को छोरो भर जन्मे सारंगी बजाने पर्ने अब बाबू बाजे तेसो भू सारंगी बजाने पर्ने अंत स्कूल पढ़िए अंत बाबूबाजे भू खो पढ़े खो के अब हम जात ने पा हो गाइने सारंगी बजाने त्या हमें सारंगी बजा पर्च हिड़ नानी छोरा नाती भैसरी साथ साथ ही लीएर हिड़ाने हुए रिके तक ऊ सिको अगर ऊ दुख सुख जिंदगी तो अब चल भन अब है कति मानी के भून अब यो हाथ खुट्टा राम्रे कें इस बाटो में बसर गाएक हो तर बुझने मं हम जहाँ जहाँ समुदाय हो गाइने गीत गाने पर्ने भाई बुझ्हु हाई हम कला संस्कृति हो जहाँ जहाँ नेपाली अब आपको कला संस्कृति संस्कार धर्म नहीं रहेन भाने हमी मानव जाति नहीं रहन दूं न जस्तु लग One language that unites people of all cultures is the reverberating sound of music. The musical hums are a single language, echoing emotion and stories without words. The voice of the sarangi is more muffled now. Nowadays, sarangi players are facing adversities. people's perception of them has changed ante yahan unharle bichara apno pet ko lagi chai yahan ab unharle yahan basera bato bichma basera gip aunu huncha hai nepal ma ta purai sa yesto sarangi bajaunu haru tara yahan ta ab chai na bisi bajai rane haru chai ra sarangi yahan tira pani sikaunu parne ke khas class hunu parne sarangi ko तो छेन सारंगी को इस क्लास न इंस्ट्रुमेंट भी पाँदन यहाँ क्या यहाँ तब को गिटार ड्रम्स मत पाँच हाई सारंगी इंस्ट्रुमेंट नहीं पाँदन क्या
भाई दुई टा पोटेटो केक कर र दुई टा जुस दिनु न Your culture, your tradition identifies you. We are all on the verge of evolution, modernization. Likewise, we are also losing our roots. In the fast changing modern India respect is no longer just a simply a question of caste respect may be acquired through education or duty or even through music There is a danger that the Gandharvas who, who play this instrument uh, will start uh, changing their profession because like their uh, traditional profession of uh, traveling and playing music uh, doesn't yield much income uh, and uh, they it also uh, deters them from getting an education and like uh, from uh, rising up in society so uh, this instrument can go out of uh, fashion in the uh, years to come so uh, we as we have to be very conscious about it and we have to start to uh, uh, spread awareness about this instrument so as to preserve it so talking about preserving sarangi uh, according to me as i'm running this academy for the past uh, 6 years um, Till now I haven't received any kind of like uh, queries that somebody would love to learn sarangi. So there can be many factors. Uh, so one could be like uh, nobody thought that sarangi can be played as a formal training lira, that sarangi mapani that they can make a career. I don't think so. I have never thought. So maybe I never received a call throughout this year. But having said that, I don't. It's not that sarangi ko ki value chahi na bani hai. If you go to Mumbai and all, in lots of Bollywood movies also, in lots of classical music also, sarangi ko afno different ways when the sarangi is still being played. But if we come back to the region we are staying right now, 
the only uh, way of preserving it is like for example i am in a music academy if i would have to teach my children and introduce sarangi to my students i think we can put a lot of workshops uh the people who are here in sikkim also like we can call them and they can come they can uh, give the uh, the structure the how the sarangi look like and they can give the um, workshop on how it can be played and what is the history behind sarangi i think you kudar leche we can aware the coming generation i think